Night. Welcome back to some more hip hop content on the YouTube channel. Now today we have a first ever album review by yours truly. Now um, this is going to be very, very, very uh, statistical <laughs> for this video. So please understand that this takes a lot of effort for me to get into these album reviews. Uh, there were some mistakes that I had to literally check before I did record, um, but nevertheless, um, it's totally fine now. So, without a doubt, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys do, make sure to leave a like if you guys want more hip hop content. And uh, if it's that, guys, enjoy the video. All right, let's get straight into it. Now we're gonna start off with the lyrics. Now remember, the lyrics are a separate thing. So I basically go through all the songs. Uh, with the lyrics and rate them and then hopefully um, as I do that I give them as the total for the lyrics as a whole and then put it on there so just make sure to be mindful of that uh, but let's just get straight into this um, so the first song we have is girl with a gun so uh, this got an 8.4 if it got an 8.5 then um, two points will not be taken off uh, but since it only got an 8.4, 8 but it got really, really close, um, it got an 8.4. So, um, yeah, there's going to be a slight chance that two points are going to be taken off. Fly Trap, again, very, very solid song. I respect it. Moving on. The Altar, one of her best songs. I respect it. And <laughs> God help me. It, it, it really, really gets into the feel of how you do things. And The Altar gives a prime example of how things can be shared in what you actually show for people so the artistry there is absolutely amazing um never seen again another solid song 8.7 8.5 for ministry this was a very 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 good song and um i really respect it and the last song to shut this one out it was bullet i actually respect this song no matter what the consequences is because it shows a very very good ending to an album because if you're talking about, especially when you're talking about a girl with a gun, what do you end it with? You end it basically how you end it with anything. With a bullet. The whole point of this album is to be passive aggressive, but in a calm melody. And that's something a lot of people have not noticed, is that she's taking a calm melody approach with this. So I'm very, very impressed with it. I, I actually very much respect what she's doing here. So uh, if you do the specific math on this, particular part uh you literally um sum up the math by um adding every single part of this and then uh minus it by 15 you get 36.8 36.8 minus 20 because there are current you're supposed to have at least an availability of 20 songs in an album uh 5 to 15 you get what i mean um and then minusing it by six because that was the um amount of songs that she had then after that literally taking off 2.0 by the intro that I literally mentioned uh, prior. So, that will give her a 8.8 .8 on the lyrics. Now, let's move on to Artistry. Artistry got an 8.9 because the art in this, particularly visually, was by far the best. I respected her in this. I think the last time she got this, it was a, at least an 8.6. So, this was an upgrade for her. So, congrats to her on that. Um, creativity got a 9 because this was probably by far the most creative I've ever seen from her. And sh this just shows that she is definitely studying her craft. She's improving and she knows what she's doing. So as a result, I guarantee you, if she keeps on going like this, she's going to at least, her rank will be at least above uh, eight, 85 because she's currently at 90 as we speak right now she's currently at 90 for the go conversation she's currently at 90 so if she literally goes all the way up and if she gets like three albums where it's going to be 8.8 .8, she's good to go she's good to go to move up she's good to go so back to the creativity at hand the most important thing that i've been impressed with her was the rhythm patterns um if you guys don't um, no, I literally basically had an 8.5 for her as far as rhythm patterns uh, during the last album she did. And by the way, this was uh, for creativity and artistry. That goes for the same thing pretty much. Uh, so it changed over time. 
So she has a 9.1 for rhythm pattern because I'm impressed with the fact that she actually kept up with every single part of not only the beat, but she knew exactly what she was doing with it. And the flow switch between them both, and that's why I gave her 8.6 at this one, because last time she had an 8.3, now she had an 8.6. But she got an 8.5 for rhythm pattern, so now she got a 9.1. This was by far her best increase that I've ever seen from her. In the figurative language, it was an 8.7, same rating as the last time. And then that's how she got an 8.8 .8 overall. Now, um, to put up the math for a, for the 8.8, uh, .8, um, I wanted to actually literally make the math a bit simple for y'all. Um, this one is going to be very, very simple. So, um, so pretty much you add it all up, like I said, you add it all up and then you basically get the total of 53. 53 minus six is 8.8. .8. So. That's how you basically make the math for that. <laughs> so I just wanted to make sure to let y'all know that I'm completely on track with that one. But nevertheless, this was actually a really, really good album. So yes, it got an 8.8. .8. Solid, solid album. Really good album from her this year. This was currently in 2021. So if you guys want to go and check out that album, it'll be in the link in the description because this was a phenomenal album. I respect this one, no matter what the consequences were. So please make sure to go check it out because my oh my did she really really go in with this one so yeah without a doubt hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys did make sure to leave a like also hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel it's been said guys later Bye.